Good day everyone and you're welcome to today's class. Now let's examine the squares we have. If root 24 plus root 96 minus root 600 equals to y root 6 and the value of y. So I will solve this and compare with this. So I will start with root 24. Root 24, I need one perfect and one imperfect. Now that means I will look at what can give me 24. 3 times 8 is 24. But 3 is imperfect, 8 also is imperfect. 6 times 4 is 24. 6 is imperfect and 4 is a perfect square. So I will use 6 times 4. Plus, the moment I have an imperfect square here, that means it will be present here and also will be present here. So 6 in 96 also will give me 6 times 16. Minus 6 in 600 is 6 times 100, of course. Now, I can separate them to be root 6 times root 4, based on the law of multiplication. And we have root 16 times root 16 minus root 6 times root 100. Now, the square root of 4 is 2. That is 2 times root 6, you give me root 6, plus... The root of 16 is 4, 4 times root 6 is 4 root 6, minus the root of 100 is 10, 10 times root 6 is 10 root 6. So, because they have the same root, I can add or subtract, 2 plus 4 is 6, 6 minus 10 is minus 4 root 6, equal to, we can bring it down, y root 6. The question is asking us to find y. That means root 6 can cancel root 6. What do we have left? We have y and we have minus 4. That means your y equals to minus 4. This is our answer. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment and follow. Bye-bye.